Hey guys, so today's video, I have a haul and hauls are my favorite kind of videos. I hit up Urban Outfitters and I bought a good amount of stuff. They were having a sale. Sales are my weakness. I also got stuff from a website called Zaffle, which I had never ordered from before, but I got this choker actually that I'm wearing. It's kind of cool. It has like suede little stripes and it's really nice and it's so cheap this choker was like three dollars so if you don't want to pay like Urban Outfitters $25 for a choker hit up Zaffle I'm pretty sure it's only an online store but they have some good stuff so let me show you what else I got from them so I got two more chokers from Zaffle the other one I got was this little plain black one that you've probably seen everywhere and it's suede on one side, the other side is just like a plain, like, kind of like ribbon material. It's really cheap quality, like, it's probably not the best. If you're looking for something high quality, don't go to this website. But for just like a simple choker to just like throw on, like, it's so basic. It's so cheap. This was like $2. I also got this choker which is like a bead choker. It looks like something from Free People, honestly. Like, it looks very intricate and like the beading is really nice. But the second I took it out of the packaging, this little like connector spot that like, you know, you need to connect your necklaces to broke. So good thing I'm a handy. And I fixed it by just like opening up one of the little clasps and then like rehooking it and then closing it again. So that worked out fine and it's like so gorgeous. I wore it yesterday because I did a shoot with my good friend Chris. Chris, if you're watching this, hey, he's a photographer. And um, I was shooting also a lookbook that I'm gonna be uploading soon, a fall lookbook. And I was shooting some pictures for an article I'm writing. We were just shooting his pictures for his photography Instagram account, which I will link down below. And they came out really good. I'm really excited. I have that lookbook to you guys next week a lot of these pieces that I'm about to show you are basically all all of them are used in the lookbook so if you want to see these styled check out my next week's video but let's continue on with the haul my next item from Zaffle is this these are super hot right now these little slip like very, what is this material called? Not silk, like kind of silky, like very smooth material, but it's this little slip dress and it's this gorgeous color. Again, the material is not that great. Like it's kind of like, it almost looks like it's pulling in spots, but like since it's really metallic, you can't even tell. There's a zipper in the back, it has like a little V. This is so cute to wear with like a white t-shirt underneath and some over the knee boots. That's what I wore it with in my lookbook. And it also comes with this little like like ribbon scarf choker and you wear it with the dress and it looks super cute and this is also a great like holiday color for Christmas and stuff coming up or like even Thanksgiving this was like super cheap also and it's so much more affordable because it's like something that's so trendy but you don't have to pay like $70 for it like in all the other stores like Urban Outfitters and stuff I got one more thing from Zaffle if I can find it here it is okay I was actually like really disappointed with this so I talked about in my last video like wearing over the knee boots with um, huge oversized sweatshirts so I figured hey let me order one because this was cheap this was like 15 16 dollars and I was like oh I'll just get it in a large so that I could wear it and it's like okay this is the sweatshirt so it's green it's army green and it has like these rips all in it and it looks cute like it looks good on camera and it looks good in the photo but you it's not like sweatshirt quality like it's this weird like shirt material and like it totally doesn't feel like just a big chunky sweatshirt that you want to like wrap yourself in it's not oversized and it actually fits like a normal size sweatshirt and I got this in a large and normally I'm like a small or a medium. So for this to fit like a normal sweatshirt, like clearly their sizings are completely off. But, so I'm kind of disappointed with this, but I guess I could still like wear it as a normal sweatshirt. 
Moving on to Urban Outfitters, probably one of my favorite stores of all time. I splurged a little bit there. First jacket I got is this. And I know I talked about denim jackets in my last video and how that denim jacket from Urban Outfitters was my favorite. Well, scratch that. This denim jacket from Urban Outfitters is my favorite. It's so freaking cute. Like, look at this. It's a great wash. It's like a light denim. And then look at the other side. Like, it has all these adorable pins. There's so many cute, like, little pins on them. The back is, like, probably the best part. The back has this, like, gorgeous snake on it with these little flowers and everything. Like, this cute detailing. I just love this. It's by the brand BDG. So, again, again like, the same as the last one, I think. And it is perfect. Mwah. So the next jacket I got was a bomber jacket and I've been wanting like a green bomber jacket for so long but whenever I would try them on in places like Topshop they were always too big or they always bunched up on the sleeves too much where it made me look like puffy and weird. It looked like I was wearing like football player pads underneath me which is not the look I was going for. I found this one in Urban Outfitters and it's like this little green it's kind of crop but like not really crop where it like goes up to your belly button and it has this gorgeous black fur collar which you can take off if you want it like unzips in the back and it's just like really great like i love it i'm probably not showing this that good but it has these big green sleeves but not too big where it bunches up and like i don't know i just love it the waistband is like this kind of material like it scrunches and it tightens and it hugs your waist which is really nice and it has like zipper detailing on the sleeves it's just really great it's really warm like the denim jacket's obviously not that warm okay hold up I walked out of my house this morning to go drive to school there is snow on my car excuse me that is not allowed to be happening in November I just don't like snow um if you live somewhere you wish you had snow, you really don't. You really don't wish you had snow. It's cold, it sucks. All of a sudden, it just turned freezing. Starting yesterday, like yesterday was brutal. Today is even worse, so there was snow. I'm just hoping it doesn't get worse than this. Honestly, can it even? This is warm, so this is a good jacket for the cold. It's not too warm where you're gonna start sweating or anything, so this is perfect. Bringing back these. These I actually didn't get too long ago. I got them like, a week before I filmed my November favorites. So I'm putting them in this haul because if you didn't see them in my last video, these are a great shoe. I highly recommend Urban Outfitters. Pick yourself up a pair. Next thing I got from Urban Outfitters was this Adidas. Like, okay, I know it's winter. I know I just talked about how there was snow outside, but I hope my camera's not about to die. Crap. It's racer back super cute super strappy you have the adidas logo here with like you can't see it that well on camera because it's that kind of rubber like silicone almost material but you can kind of see it super cute super good for summer i'm going to the british virgin islands in february and this will be perfect for that next thing i got is a phone case i got this Super cute. Slight technical difficulties. Once again, it said my SD card ran out of storage, but then I checked on my computer and there was barely anything on my SD card. So I had to reformat it to the camera and transfer everything over. Such a process. I always have issues. I completely forget what I was talking about. I think I was up to this super cute phone case. It's called the Bella Eye Case. And I love it. It's from Urban Outfitters. It's super cute, gold, girly. Perfect. The thing I got from Urban Outfitters was this candle. Urban Outfitters has like the best candles. It's called Afterlight and it smells so good. It kind of smells like a mix of boy and like forest night. It smells so good. I love it. If you are Dominique, Faith, or my parents, don't watch this video because... I'm going to share some little birthday slash Christmas things I've already picked up. And yes, although it is 
Thanksgiving in three days. I have started getting Christmas gifts because I love Christmas. I love buying gifts for people. I just love everything about Christmas. You kind of get to show people how well you really do know them because like you pick out their gifts and like you match just their personalities. So for my parents, I doubt they would ever watch this video, but I got them this record from our bin and it's um, Depeche Mode. It's their ultra album and this is the concert that my parents met at so I thought I'd get this for them a little bit of a sentimental gift I know I'm so sweet if you're Dominique stop watching this right now skip over because this is your birthday present first thing we got her was an album and me and Dominique went to a Dominique and I went to a concert at Carnegie Hall like not that long ago a couple months and um, we went to see Darren Chris because he's like her favorite person ever from Glee. And this is an album from a uh, from live performance at Carnegie Hall of a guy named Ryan Adams. And I listened to his music before I bought this. And in my last video, I talked about music that kind of like gives me the feels is my favorite kind of music right now. This album is completely that. Dominique is just like me where she loves listening to that kind of music. So me and Faith both got her this. And then we also got her a coloring book because she loves to color and this is just like very her like some of the things in here it's like you color like things like this like little fun drawings and she's really creative so I know she's gonna make the best out of like all these little pictures. We also got her this game it's called who is most likely to and it looks really fun I love card games like this it's it's almost like a cards against humanity kind of game like who in your friend group is most likely to wake up with half a burrito in bed? Like, duh, Dominique. Then we also got her a mug because she loves mugs. So this is a cute little panda mug. And it changes colors when you put like a hot drink in it or something. So this is a good gift for her. We also got her cute little socks from Forever 21. And these are little panda socks to like match her panda mug. And we got her these sushi socks because um, last year, or in when we went to Boca Raton, go watch our Boca Raton vlogs, link down below. We went to a sushi restaurant and Dominique had sushi for the first time in her life. And she ate a piece of like raw squid or something weird, not squid, something like crazy, raw eel or something. And she said it threw off her feng shui and like... I don't know, these just reminded me and Faith of that. So, we got them for her. Next thing, Faith, if you're watching this, stop watching this. I got Faith a coloring book from Urban Outfitters as well. This is called Cats in Paris, and Faith loves cats. She likes color. These are all about cats. Faith has a cat named Spot. She's obsessed with her cat. So, I thought I would get her this cute little thing to do in her free time. Next store I went to was Forever 21 and the only thing I got were those socks and this huge like sweater jacket kind of. So okay this is really hard to show. Um, It's really big. It has these really nice pockets and it's so soft and like fuzzy and nice and it has these big sleeves and the neck kind of like folds over super cute i styled this in my lookbook so go check that out i actually wore this with the dress and then my over the knee boots so it's a really good to just throw over something it's so warm it basically doubles as a jacket and a sweater you can kind of just use it for whatever you want and it's perfect for like dressing something up or you could dress it down so that is everything i have for this haul I hope you guys enjoyed just another chill sit down video maybe next week you will watch my lookbook so be on the lookout for that if you want to see all these things styled also leave me a comment down below I feel like no one watches these videos except for like three friends that I know that always watch them so if you're alive and kicking and doing well comment down below Tell me anything. Tell me what your favorite food is. Tell me what your favorite story is. Your favorite movie. I love movies. I will literally have a 45 minute discussion with someone about like one scene in a movie. I could talk about movies forever. 
So leave a comment about anything down below. And follow my Instagram, Twitter, add me on Snapchat. I am going to start using Depop because I've heard a lot about it. And I have a lot of clothes that I feel like I probably should get rid of because I'm a clothing hoarder. So might as well pass along the fashion. So I might start doing that. So I'll have a link to my Depop username down below. It's just Kayla Kilfoyle if you want to add me. And that is all for this video. I will see you guys next week. Bye. I think like this is a really good month for fashion. Definitely during the fall time. Sorry, I'm peeling a clementine right now. I love the smell of clementines. Like actually.